I still remember the day I first laid eyes on her. My jaw dropped when she walked in the room, and I've regretted opening my mouth ever since. You O'Leary? That's what it says on the door. I hear you're the best. Well, that and a nickel will get you a shoe shine. Then I'll be straight. Two nights ago, my husband Henry went to Lou's bar and nobody's seen him since. You ever been to Lou's bar? Of course. And that's when the trouble started. You see, I lied like a rug. I've never been to Lou's bar in my life, but it was too late to turn back now. My reputation was on the line. Then you know Lou, of course. I do. I did not. Uh, yeah, a real hard-boiled guy loves to talk baseball but could use a breath mint. You got Lou's number all right. Bullseye. Took a shot in the dark and it was right on target. Well, Lou said the last time he saw Henry he was headed downstairs to the card room. And everyone knows what goes on in Lou's card room. Of course not. Yeah, so you think that Henry got involved in betting on the old ball game? What now? Uh, betting on the old ball game of bootlegging. Bootlegging? Prohibition is over. Bootlegging? It, legs in boots? It, prostitution, dollface. The mob runs an underground poker game out of Lou's card room. That's what I'm trying to say, toots. The old ball game of bootlegging, meaning knocking boots with the mob. Uh, Louie's in bed with the mafia. Uh, private eye talk. Sorry if I lost you there. Uh, try to keep up. Stupid. Smoke. Like a chimney. Detective, are you all right? <coughs> sure. I uh, just need to wash it down with some brandy. Uh, would you like a drink, Sugar Buttons? I don't drink. Good thing. I didn't have any brandy. Too bad. We could have uh, drank all night. Probably for the best, though. Last time I got buzzed on the beat, an innocent man wound up in jail. What? Well, it's a funny story. It wasn't. So my old partner's in town from Baltimore and- Look at me go! I could have stopped talking at any point, but I kept digging myself deeper. I tend to do that around pretty dames. I don't know why. I guess I just want to seem smart and savvy and sharp and one step ahead of everyone else. I've blown some really big cases because I'd rather cover up a lie than solve a case. Boy, I'm a moron. A grade A top shelf board certified moron. Anyway. When I wake up the next morning, I realize that I had tossed out the evidence with the pea-stained pants, and this poor innocent fella got sent up the river. Enough! Hey, what's the big idea? That innocent man you sent to prison was my husband. I'm sorry. I was. It's too late for sorries, detective. Now be a good boy and lie down. <laughs> oh! Sorry I lied about not having any brandy, folks. I'm hiding a horrible drinking problem. <sighs> and I soiled myself. It's too late for sorries, detective. Now be a good boy and lie down. Oh, you know what? Tonight? Oh, you're so helpful, thank you. Sure. It's, it's my first time. Does, 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 okay. it, does the trigger work? Yes. Go ahead and okay. talk about it. Uh, now be a good boy and lie down.